right, thank you very much, Richard. The holiday fire burned through the streets of Goleta Friday night and into Saturday morning, sweeping up houses and structures in its path. Some residents returned home only to find nothing left standing. KSBY's Chance Dickman has the story of one family who just moved to the area and are left with ashes. I never even imagined that this would be our life two weeks after we moved here. For Eric Durchie and his family of eight, brand new residents of Goleta, a new beginning was put to a stop by the holiday fire, and it all happened so fast. We were in this side room, and we had the windows open in there, air conditioning on in the rest of the house, and one of my kids came out and said, what is that smoke smell? And as soon as I opened the front door, it was just white. Eric discovered the fire just a few blocks away. He quickly called his wife to get their six children and guests out of the house because the wind was blowing the fire right in their direction. And thank goodness they and their family had had this two minute fire prep thing. So I don't panic, but I didn't really know what to do. So he just kind of took charge and he's like, grab this, grab this, get out of there. And as I was walking out, there were fist sized embers falling all over the place. And I saw the actual fire right behind us. It was at that moment when Eric realized the inevitable was going to happen. So I knew, I, I knew the house was gone, but the kids were out and safe and it was, it was scary. It was going so fast. The wind was gusting so fast last night. There was no chance. I can't believe any of these houses survived. It's crazy. A few residents returned to check out the damage, but like this home behind me, as well as many others along Fairview Avenue, Eric returned to find his house completely gone just two weeks after he and his family moved in. Uh, yeah, what was kind of your initial thought? I just, I just needed to prepare myself so that it wasn't as big of a shock when I tell the family so I could be strong for them and lead them through it. So I just wanted to come and see it wrap my head around it so that whenever I go and tell them I can be strong and composed and here's the plan. Here's what we're going to do, which I still don't know, but I'm figuring it out. Reporting in Goleta, I'm Chance Dickman for KSBY News.